Welcome back. Today I'm gonna go over a tutorial on how to find out your uh, DSLR uh, shutter count or uh, accusations before you purchase your uh, DSLR uh, camera. I would suggest you uh, ask a seller to send you a photo that they take with the their camera and they could send it to you and once you receive that uh, files you could uh, see uh, what is the actual uh, shutter count on the original camera so you won't get a uh, rip off by paying too much if it, the camera is too old with uh, so many uh, shutter count. So I'm gonna go ahead and, and uh, take a picture of this uh, Nikon D90 box that I have that, come, that came with my uh, camera. And after that, on the next video, I will show you on how to uh, go to like a different uh, website to find out the actual uh, shutter count okay so oh by the way my uh, battery is uh, getting charged so let me grab it real quick from the charger so I could do this uh, test for you guys okay so just be patient give me a little second So let's go ahead and then uh, insert my battery. So right now it's set on automatic. I'm going to go ahead and then I take out my cab and snap a picture of this uh, box. So here's a picture and then uh, I'm going to upload this picture to a website and it will show you uh, what is the shutter count on my camera okay so let's go ahead and then uh, move it to the next video so be patient okay so here we are I'm going to uh, transfer in, uh, my file that I took earlier I'm going to take out my uh, memory card, the SD card. Okay. And I'm going to put in the adapter and then uh, transfer in that file or pull out the file from the computer. So well, now you see the file that's in there right now. So let's cancel that. I'm not gonna import those picture. So it shows that the uh, Nikon D90 uh, over there. So next video I'm going to show it to you I'm going to do a screen recording 
and I will show it to you so it's more uh, clear that way, okay? So before you go to uh, any website, you want to go to search for sh shutter count. And then you got a whole bunch of uh, different website that's coming up. So normally I use the my shuttercounts.com and I'm going to upload that photo that I took earlier. You go click on the choose file. I'll go into my uh, D90 uh, folder. DCIM. So it will be the last picture that I took. And after that, you click on uh, Upload. So it's up, it says uh, Uploading right now. And it tells you uh, what is the shutter count right there. 5,000, I mean 59,625. And today's uh, upload time, file name, camera model name, exposure compensations, exposure uh, time, flash mode, focal uh, length, F number, and then the ISO. So if you come to this website, you will did the shutter count for most uh, DSLR uh, cameras, like the Sony Alpha, Nikon, uh, Canyon, Olympus, and uh, Etc. Okay. So this is uh, this is how you uh, check your shutter account. So keep, please give a thumbs up and like the video and subscribe to our channel. And please uh, share this with your friends, family, or social uh, media. So uh, if any of them are looking for uh, cameras, uh, use one. Make sure they check. Check the shutter count out first before uh, they go out there and purchase one because uh, you want to make your uh, money worth a while. You don't want to just throw, end up throwing away when the DSLR is about to die and then you buy them at a uh, couple hundred dollars and just a couple of months later on the road, it, your camera dies out with a new purchase. So uh, just be smart and then uh, shop around and do some uh, shutter count before you go out there and spend your money. And make sure you don't buy refurbished one either because uh, I used to own a cell phone store and I, I sell refurbished uh, cell phone. A lot of them, a lot of them uh, came back to me. So make sure you don't buy refurbished refurbished electronic items, okay? So just uh, give you a heads up and give you some tips around uh, for that. So thank you for watching, and then I'll see you on the next video. Peace.